Oh man, why is this room so green? It's like everything but the ceiling is green in this room. Why, why do you think they did that? Hey everyone, welcome to another quick question. This week, we're talking all about Far Cry 5. Oh boy, Far Cry 5, a lot of baggage. It's a good game, story, just not hanging. Anyway, thank you so much to everyone who submitted questions about this game. I reviewed it, you can check out my review on CNET, but for now, let's get to the questions. Chase says, first one I have played, so what do I have to expect from this game? Well, Far Cry 5 is this open world action adventure first person shooter game where you're slowly building resistance to take down a religious and dangerous cult. You grow your arsenal, you can hire people to help fight with you, you take down posts, then you take down sections of the map, and then you go after the main guy. So that's what you can expect. If you don't like shooters, you're not gonna like this game. If you don't like violence and blood and awful things, you're not gonna like this game. So I hope that helps. Isn't this game just the same thing as the other Far Cries? Is that a good or a bad thing? It is a lot similar to the other Far Cry games, but it is the most refined and streamlined and accessible one in the series. And I think in terms of just the gameplay, it's my favorite. Phil says, what would Far Cry be like if it took place in New Jersey? <laughs> okay, Far Cry 6 colon NJ. It would just be hours and hours of mindless bumper to bumper gridlock traffic making your way into the Lincoln Tunnel. And that's all the game would be. Everyone would hate it or kill themselves before they finished playing. Tony, did I make the best Far Cry 5 GIF? Let's have a look. What the f... Oh no, don't, don't, oh my God. You might have. I just feel like Far Cry New Jersey, you would get a hockey stick so you can bash someone's taillights out and that's the only weapons you would have in your entire wheel. All the perks would just be like, oh, you're level six at cursing at somebody. Dom says, hey, quick question. Far Cry 5 is awesome so far, but how do you feel about NPCs, non-playable characters? Sometimes capturing areas independently of your own actions. It happened to me with Fall's End. That's crazy, man. That never happened to me. I finished the entire game. I don't like when these people just sort of take your helicopter and fly away without you inside it. That's annoying but I've never had anyone capture stuff without me. That is weird, I'd like to see that. Sean, does a crying fart have more substance than whatever Far Cry 5's message is supposed to be? Sean, you're not wrong. The story, the messaging, all that in Far Cry 5 is kind of a mess. But for what it's worth, I do think it is very difficult to send a specific narrative across in a huge open world kind of unpredictable game. You see a cutscene, and then hours and hours and hours and hours and hours go by, and then another cutscene. It's not as easy to do that as it is in maybe a linear game. But at the same time, yes, they dropped the ball on the messaging. It's a bad look. Zach says, I drunk purchased the $90 version with the season pass. How much money did I waste? Technically, you wasted $30, but there's DLC coming. I just don't know if it's worth it. They're doing like a zombie one. They're doing one that takes place in Vietnam and then one that takes place on Mars. So there's a range there. Is it good? I don't know, I haven't played any of it. Is it gonna be good? I haven't really seen any of it. So you've potentially wasted $30. But I think if you bought it after the fact, it's gonna be more money. So hold on, I'll let you know if you wasted money. Have you ever tried to purchase anything that you regretted? Almost everything I own. Oh. Bemused Chunk. Will this be the final Far Cry game? Uh, probably not. They seem like they sell very well. I mean, they've made five, they've made a sixth if you include Far Cry Primal, so I don't think this series is necessarily going anywhere anytime soon. He also asks, uh, what is the best flavor combination of bagel slash cream cheese? Mine is cinnamon raisin with the walnut raisin cream cheese. That's pretty good, I respect that. Uh, I, yeah, you don't like that, Nick? I'm sorry that this person's taste disgusts you. I like, um, I'll, go, I'll do two things. I like an everything bagel with a lox cream cheese. I'm a fan of that. Or uh, you can go down the route of, and this is not for everybody, I realize that. You can do sesame bagel with strawberry cream cheese. At Mount Skull Crusher, 
Far Cry 6 has a celebrity antagonist, but they have to play themselves. Who do you cast? My pick is Jeff Goldblum. Good pick. I love it. Hmm. Let's go with Jeremy Irons. I think he could do it. I just love him as the villain in Die Hard 3, so I just like, I always want to see him do that again. Oh, you know what you could do? You could do the, the entire cast of the Jersey Shore. Oh wait, I think we've just really actually created Far Cry 6, New Jersey. All right, that's gonna do it for another episode of Quick Question. Thank you so very much for submitting your quick question. If you wanna leave one for next week, please put it in the comment section below. Please like this video. Please subscribe to this channel and we'll see you next time. I just, <laughs> I just can't. You're like, actually. That's the worst news I've heard all day.